the standard this year is very good. Um, there's there's a nice variation this year. It's probably the, no, the the nicest variation. There's a old school platformer. It's a path optimizer, meaning there are multiple paths, but there is one optimal one. The game for the iPhone, and it's a co-op action tower defense game, 3D puzzle platformer set in a virtual reality world that will utilize the power of the Oculus Rift uh, virtual reality headset. A 2D platformer where you solve games by punching things with your shadow. It's a, I think that's a very nice selection. Um, and technically all of them are very strong and artistically there's some very strong art teams that are very art led so I think it's a very nice balance this year and I don't think there's a, a weak team amongst them so the decision will actually be very tough. Being in school or in the real world is not the same same so it is you know you need them to come out of their shells and trying to be proactive and be different uh, even if different is not always good but be bringing something that you've never seen before and as a judge that's what you want something you never seen before and you actually thinking in two years time I can sign that game and I can make money out of that game um, yeah I think we're pretty well prepared we've done uh, several weeks of uh, preparation for this getting uh, the game idea together and getting a decent representation of what the game will probably look like from a, from a point of view of art style and um, what, what the feeling will be from a, from a storytelling and narrative point of view. Well, we've uh, been working, I suppose, since February and um, we're going to head in, on in now for the presentation. But expectations-wise, I'm um, not too sure. I mean, we've, pra we've uh, practiced this until it's just like, you know, we all just know it off by hand now. So. There was a lot of preparation. There was the last maybe couple of weeks have just been making presentations, rehearsing constantly. Spent a lot of time making a prototype and make, making art for it to show the judges. The, the teams are quite interesting. It's, they're excited about it and we are excited about it because that brings and shows that Ireland has a lot of potential and have a lot of great talent. So it's great. It's actually doing really great. I think that went really well. Yeah. What do you think? <laughs> like, I was terrified that they weren't going to ask any questions afterwards and it was like, my God, they have questions. They're actually interested. Maybe that's a good thing. So overall, we got across our points. So fingers crossed we get through. Um, I feel it went pretty well. Um, yeah, I was, I was pretty happy. I mean, we, we got across everything that we wanted to get across. I don't think we really left out anything or stuttered too much. And um, yeah, by the end, it was like kind of all the nerves kind of dissipated in the room and it was just it was flowing pretty well. I was pretty happy with it, yeah. Pretty happy with it. Felt we got across what we wanted to say. We told them I think I think we tried to sell them the idea that the Oculus Rift is going to be something successful and that was a probably the big the hardest part of it but I feel like we've succeeded in doing that. Uh, we were not sure how it went they didn't ask as many questions as we thought uh, we think it went well but we can never be sure.